Do you guys ever see those videos when somebody's like reviewing a shoe or a sneaker? And I always just find it so awkward because they're always like, 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 I don't know what they're doing. They're like, <laughs> ow! <laughs> anyway, they're like doing these different, like, moves. Whatever, dudes. I'm just going to take these off in a second. But I'm showing you my outfit first, and I don't know if the flash is going to fuck this up. Hey! Hello! Uh, so, like, somebody commented. I gotta get rid of all these dumb stickers. You can't really see what's going on, can you? Anyway, I got the, the Thursday boots. That's what this video is about. And then you got yourself an Express Turtleneck hoodie. Pretty dope. And then, uh, Levi's 501 Dark Denims. I mean, 510 skinnies. They're, uh, they're not, like, ultra skinny. Yeah, they're pretty tight. You can still rock a gun. I don't have it on me because I'm at home chilling, but uh, I you can easily wear it. Now somebody said, you, last time I jacked my pants up like that was in the 1980s. Dude, come on, man. You're way off in your timeline. This is more like in the 1930s look, except more, way better, way better. You ever see like the Titanic? You know, uh, what Leonardo DiCaprio was wearing in the movie, Jack, I think his name was. Oh, but Jack, you can't swim. I, I don't know. I forget the lines. But anyway, that's more of like the style. It's an English style. And it's a dope style. And it's going to get you laid if you pull it off right. But anyway, we won't judge what you're wearing. So, this is what's going on. Here's, here's what they do in the videos, though. They're like... Like... Doing all this, like, I don't know. <laughs> I know you guys know what I'm talking about. Anyway, let's go over here. Tabletop. Okay, so here we are. With the Thursday boots. The captains, they call them. These are cap-toed. Alright, in case you don't know what that means. That means the toe is capped. They make a wing tip. Which means that it's like a, you know, that stitching. These are fucking fly, dude. Yo, these are seriously the dopest boots that I've ever owned in my life. I mean, my work boots are a pair of Thorough Good Mock Toes. And I've had them for a year and I bust my ass in them every day. And they're just legit, like, the most well-built boot that I've had because I work, like, in, around heavy equipment. And you can style them, no doubt, but they're not, like, these are just, like, look at it. I mean, they're just, just look at it. Just look at it. They're so sick. Guys, Thursday boots, I'm getting all the colors. I'm getting black. I'm getting the cat, uh, the, the non-cap toe. Uh, I'm going to get definitely a pair of Chelsea suede boots. Chelsea boots are so fly. Yo, these boots are so sick. And, like, why would you want to pay? And they're $200. They're handmade, real le leather. The insides of them, <laughs> they're probably the most comfortable boot I've ever put on in my entire life. Handmade in small batches. Yeah, they're handmade in Mexico. They're not actually handmade in the United... Ugh, sorry, in the United States. But, like... Oh, guys... When I'm telling you that these things are legit, just they're so comfortable, your foot just kind of like, like you know how when you holster a weapon in a leather holster, or like even a Kydex holster, it just makes that kind of like pop sound, like that's what these do, and they're just like, look at how they look, they're amazing. So like when somebody's like, I don't roll my pants up. Dude, you're going to roll your pants up when you're wearing these boots because if you don't, you're doing it wrong. Why would you hide this boot, this beautiful boot? You don't hide this. You you show this. You want to show that. And you don't wear it like a gangster either, like with the tongue hung out. Although, I guess you probably could. But you don't. You wear them just how I had them. And you can lace them all the way and put them rock super tight. But I like them a little bit loose. 
and that's how I wear them. And uh, the rubber sole, not leather, and that's going to help you. There it is right there. Handmade, designed in New York, handmade in Mexico. Um, there's like these, look at the steel, like, studs hammered through the, they're, they're so sick. They are awesome. Guys, this leather is soft. Like, they are out of the box just like you pop your foot in and you're like, oh, these are going to hurt. And then like a half hour of wearing them, it just goes away. Like, it just, they're going to, they're going to wear really well. I've already scuffed them up. I don't give a shit. Like, yeah, fuck it. Like, oh my god, my boots. Dude, boots are meant to be worn and beat. So, that's the look that they're going to get. I mean, they're just, they're so amazing. And the laces are pretty dope. No complaints on the laces. Um, yeah. Alright, so like, check this out. Ready? So like, you know how, like, when you holster a gun, it's just like this. You just, uh, you just get that lock. You know what I mean? They're so fucking sick. And then when you take them out, it's kind of like the same thing. It's just like, it's like popping your dick out of a vagina after you just blew a huge load in it. It's just like, you know what I mean? Like the queef. It's a boot queef. Yes. That's what it is. It's a boot queef. Anyway, Thursday boots, man. Oh, they're just awesome. I love this company. I Who did I watch that made me fall in love with this boot company I believe it was um the gents lounge um Blake and George over there at the at the uh at the um oh my god the gents lounge they they're they're just they're just a couple of real classy fellas guys you know what I mean awesome Oh, speaking of which, I don't have the new watch on, but it's in the room. They sent me two bands, two black leather bands. How sick is that? How sick are these boots? And the color is amazing. Especially when you, and you can rock these, I mean, all year. You can, you can wear these all year long. Summer, spring, you maybe change the color out a little bit. Black is back this year in case you haven't heard the news fashion week was all about black 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 everybody had black on so like you know rock some black if you want because it's coming back this year even in the summer but i like to be a little bit more colorful i'm going to switch it up i've like have a huge pile of my old clothes and now i have all new stuff that i hooked up this time so yeah, I just wanted to do a quick look on them for you guys to check them out. Thursday boots. Don't be afraid to to roll your jeans. No one's gonna say shit. I have literally ha never had so many compliments on. Oh my god, your sweater. Where'd you get them boots? Somebody asked me today if I was an MMA fighter, and I had to ask her. I said. Why do you think that about me? And she says, just the way you're walking. I said, the way I'm walking? And she goes, yeah, with like confidence, your head up. And I'm like, it just, when you start to dress a little bit more nicer and a little bit more better than everybody else that they is around, you're going to change the way people look at you. When you are the best dressed person in the room, when you're the person that keeps your head up, when you're the person that smiles, when you're the only person that's walking with confidence, when you're walking like an alpha male, People are going to treat you differently, and they have been. And it's it's I see such a difference, and not only in because like I'm wearing these boots, but like when you put stuff like this on and you really start to build your confidence level up, I mean, people just look at you differently. And like I'm a confident person already, so like this just adds to it, and it's just an amazing feeling when somebody asks you, "Are you an MMA fighter?" And I, of course, I said, "Yeah, yeah, that that's me." Yup, you got me. And they just smiled, and I asked her, I said, why do you think that? And she goes, just the way you walk, you can tell. And I'm like, yeah, but I'm not. And she goes, well, you walk with, like, extreme, like, confidence. And I'm like, whoa, that's fucking awesome. So, I love them. And I love that that happened today, because that just was like, wow, okay, well, I'm awesome then. 
Of course I'm fucking awesome. These boots are awesome. This is a 10 minute tabletop review of the Thursday boots. Cap toe in brown. Beautifully stitched. Beautiful hand-picked leather. Here's the note from Thursday. Your Thursday boots were handcrafted with the highest quality leather from the best tanneries in North America. Selected for its durability and character, this leather will look even better with time and repeated wear. That's why you don't bitch when you scuff these. I mean, yeah, take care of them, but like when you get a like when they get worn, that's the, the idea. Like leather looks better in time. While you break in your boots, we recommend using either leather balm or suede cleaner and a horsehair brush to buff away any blemishes. For more tips on keeping your boots fresh for years to come, email us or visit our website. Thursday is every day. And then there's this card here. This came in a package. Just a couple different styles. You can wear it. Obviously, each style has the boot showing. You got to show the boot. Now, you don't have to cut. Like, you can wear it with the with the cuff. I just don't think it looks right. I like this more style better. Couple of Chelsea boots and suede. Ah, uh, sick. Just sick, sick, sick. Look at the tiger cat thing hugging it. I'm sorry about the glare. Look at this guy. He's chilling. I mean, that's not how I would go that far, but you know, it works though. You can do whatever you want with these things, man. Just get creative. It's just. I love them. I absolutely love them. I love the design. Like, it just reminds me of running around on the Titanic's deck. And, like, this is what I feel like these old English mobsters would wear. You know, like an old Irish mobster. This is what he had on. With his, with his pants cuffed up, like, working in a, you know, pit somewhere. And then coming out with a, like, Bill the Butcher, man. Bill the Butcher wore, wore these guys. This, this, this is what he had on. You know what I mean? Like, come on, he's the captain. Bill the Butcher. This is like the whole... I feel like that's how they, like, design these off. Like, you can just see it. Just the way they look. With the heel, the... They're just amazing. Anyway, go buy them. Go buy them. Spend all your money on them. Do it! This is not a promotion for Thursday boots. Obviously, I don't have that kind of pull. And even if I did, I wouldn't wear them if they weren't dope. Oh my god, I got a scuff mark. Probably for me bumping my cell phone into it. Anyway, that's it, guys. I have work tomorrow. Mandatory. Pff, time and a half. Who cares? Anyway, I'll catch you guys later. Peace. Thursday Boots. Willie Billy out.